I've got lots of design ideas, but I'm not always equipped with the knowledge on how to make them happen. So it's really important for me to team up with the right people to help my visions come to life. All right, so now that we've got a plan, let's get pro posts here to install these steel pile posts. What, what's happening outside right now? Well, they're making a big hole. And they're making six big holes. For Wait, so, so you could actually fall in there? No, they're gonna fill them back in. But what mom, is it gonna be a very big hole? Well, did you see the hole that they had the post, the steel post in? See, there's like a long post sticking out of the ground? Yeah. And then that hole, and then they filled it back in with the rock and the dirt. And then those are called steel pile posts, and they're very, very strong, so that the deck can be built on top of it, and it'll never move, no matter what the weather. We'll always be safe when we're on the deck. Was there any rocks that made it not move there? They had to dig out a few big rocks, I think. I saw some big rocks that they dug out. Wow. Did they find any animals? No, they wouldn't find any animals. Maybe just some some salamanders or some worms. Salamanders! <laughs> well, salamanders eat worms, so. Bill from Pro Post Foundation is here, and I had six of these steel pile posts put into my backyard yesterday. And now when you look back at my backyard, it doesn't really look like it was disturbed. These are called helical piers. Yes. Screw piles is another name yeah. for them. A post will carry about 7,000 pounds. So you need a significantly larger piece of concrete to support the same load. Nothing pleases me more than speed and efficiency. These helical pile posts were a solid decision.